As seen from the animated assembly of the valves within this presentation, several components are required to complete a valve. Assembly takes place with a specific valve size and model allocated to its own bench area, having all required components, seals and fastenings ready to hand. After assembly, the individual valves are tested without top plate. Pre-production valves of all types are type tested to failure in excess of industry standards. All model designs have been subjected to finite stress analysis to ensure the adequacy of the design. At the test station, 100% testing of all valves is carried out in accordance with recognised test standards by both hydraulic and pneumatic methods. Hydrostatic testing is carried out in a purpose-made test rig and comprises a pressure test of the valve body and seals in the open mode followed by repeat tests in the closed mode in both the flow and reverse flow direction. Water pressure is maintained in all cases to a specific time and must remain constant for the allocated period. On successful completion of the hydrostatic test, valves are transferred to a pneumatic test station. Valves are located with the inlet or outlet flange face horizontal with the disc, ball or flap in the closed position. A reservoir is attached over the uppermost face and filled with water to a prescribed level. A guard is added as a safety measure. Low pressure air is fed through the test rig into the lower half of the closed valve while the reservoir above is inspected for any air bubbles rising from the seals and seats. Valves have to be bubble tight for the specified test time period. Any valve not passing a specified hydraulic or pneumatic test is rejected and after reassembly and adjustments may be retested. Valves that successfully complete final testing are dried, cleaned and depending on if destined for manual, gear operated or actuator operated can be fitted with a top plate or left bare stem. The finish accepted valves are labelled in strict accordance with serial number and operating specification, all component parts numbers having been recorded for optimum traceability in accordance with ISO 9001 procedures. Valves are then packed in bubble wrap and mesh bags inside fully detailed labelled tri-wall cardboard boxes. Appropriate levers are packed in separate tubular containers for manually operated valves and the packed products transferred to storage pre-dispatched to the client.